I move on to QS and I've got a few QS and now I must be must must tell you that I'm a big SQ fan so so I'll save those last and get the smaller portions later. Now this is a very now here's um from Ovation Records if I can zoom out here. Here's a compatible four channels stereo compilation on by Ovation Records. Very nice here. And I got this in Amoeba in 2010. And side one um side one's got, this is mostly stuff they released on their label. All the tracks are wonderful in my opinion in my opinion. You don't have to take my word for it. Side one starts with sound effects that demonstrates Real Matrix or QS. You can play th play these QS albums on through uh, Adobe Adobe um, Pro Logic 2 in this music setting, and it gives excellent Q uh, results. Yes, the Electronic Whirlpool, a motorcycle, tree cutting, jet planes. Then we go to some. Some instrumental on side one, a live performance of of a track called Jungle Root. A lot of great stuff, a few um few pop rock stuff. Then then we go to some easy listening tracks on side side two. That's my I think that's my favorite side of this album. Fly Baby Fly by the uh Don Tweedy chorus. Costco Drag it is really nice. It's um like a baroque piece with a little jazz. Now, cut four is actually my favorite. "Take Me Inside Your Heart" by a woman named Laura. Oh, I forgot what her name is. Laura something. It's on. She's she's her album's on um on iTunes. Um, Laura Yeager. I'm sorry. Yeah, Laura Yeager. Yeager. Um, did this a fantastic cut. Then we got Magnificat by Palestrina by the Paul Horn, by Paul Horn and the, the concert ensemble, and we end with the Games People Play. Very sweet album. Next we got some Christmas. Next I have got Christmas albums. We've got Christmas with Robert Shaw. This is a condensed version of a two LP set, released by Box. And like all Vox recordings, um, this is a recorded in in QS um, with a Matrix Dakota by Sansui. Got a little Courier, uh, I think it's Courier and Ives painting right here. And we've got great tracks, this, including including a piece from from the um, from a Mall in the Night Business by Minority. Wonderful album I played during Christmas, and another one I played, I played during Christmas. Another dollar treasure from Amoeba Music. The world rejoices. This is a very interesting album. It's got great stuff from America. Oh, excuse me. This particular uh, Christmas album is very nice. It's got music from England, France, Germany, Ireland, Scotland, Spain, the United States, the Philippines, the Ukraine. And it sounds great in either in four channel QS or maybe XQ with some some results, or just plain stereo. But overall, this is one of my favorite albums. This is the Greg Singers, the Dorothy Shaw Bell Choir, with Greg Smith who arranged and conducted the entire conducted the album. Very good. Okay, okay. There's nothing wrong with the. Nothing wrong with uh, beautiful art here. Anyways, um, Rachmaninoff's Concerto Number no. Two and and a rhapsody and a theme of Pagnini. I think though this piece is what what Eric Harmon based all by myself on. Um, and we have Abby Smith and the St. Louis St. Louis Symphony Orchestra by Leonard Slatkin. Turnabout is one of the QS albums. Um, it's quad. Stereo compatible. Beautiful piece. Okay, next we've got um Leonard Slacken in the St. Louis Orchestra. This is the final album in QS. Um 
they're doing music from Mis um, George Gershwin, An American in Paris, Catfish Roll, a Sweet from Porgy and Bess, and Promenade. And for all you fans of Laker Love, uh, and for all you fans of Licorice Pizza, I've got a Licorice Pizza sticker. This was sold for three ninety nine. And that's about does it with the QS.